friends and welcome to a very special series that will now be starting on my channel called Rags to Riches Rival Stars Edition. Now if you don't know what this is, essentially I did the story mode way way back, I think it was like two years ago when Rival Stars came out and I never actually recorded it for my channel. So I've decided today to go through a full playthrough of the Rival Stars game, however the twist is my main accounts usually have 200 million gold on them from all my grinding and racing and all of that. So I've decided that I'm gonna try to go from the starter gold money that you get at the beginning of the game all the way to 200 million gold. Now I do invite any other content creators or even you as viewers to participate in this challenge because I haven't seen it done on Rival Stars yet so I'm really excited to jump into it. Now before we start you can add me on Steam, my name is Abigail Pinehaven and I'll leave a link to it down below. So let's go ahead and start the game. Okay we'll start a cloud save, I think I've got one for this. Now I haven't played the beginning of this game in absolutely ages um, so I don't know if anything Things change, but if I remember correctly, this is awesome. First out of the gates is <sighs> Destiny's Dream. Beauty's suspicion right up there with the leader. Oceans win in second. Beauty's suspicion. In this first. is so cool. Cash Harrell up against them. This music is everything. Nocturnal Rider. Okay, so this is like the tutorial bit uh, where obviously you learn to play the game, but I've played quite a lot, so I think I'm okay here. Um, and if I remember correctly, this is the player that we're going to be's grandfather. So this is like his final race or something. Um, so that's, ooh, I should do the tutorial, otherwise it won't let me finish properly. Okay, let's go! Let's go! Yeah! Oh, photo finish! Finishing on a high note. That's what the paper said of your grandfather's final victory. And it was well deserved. But I was there. I knew the reason he did it was for the thrill, the sport, and especially family. This is so sweet. Your father was already comfortable in his own saddle and making a name for himself. But when your proud grandfather strolled from the stage, leaving him alone in the sun, oh, he took off like an untamed wind. That's so sweet. But then, of course. Oh yeah, he had an accident. You know how hard it was on the family. Really? But your grandfather took it the hardest. For all his achievements, in the end, he considered himself a failure. Oh. I still believe in your family's legacy, despite everything. If you could, if you would be persuaded, please come back. I think this is Francis, isn't it? I believe together we can return this homestead to the height of its glory days yours faithfully yeah. francis kwan francis is a real one francis never gave up on us that's so sweet okay now i'm really excited to get started again because my goodness that is such an epic intro like congrats oh yeah so this wasn't in the original one because you couldn't like name your ranch but now you can um so francis says you're here i'm glad you answered my letter with you at the helm i believe you can work this place back to its former glory we need what we need is a fresh start it's your ranch now you should pick a new name and logo okay definitely gonna go with pinehaven acres and um there are some really gorgeous logos to pick from but i'm pretty sure i picked one that was like had like trees in it. Is it? Aha! Here. So it's this like lovely mountain range and it's got like the trees because Pine Haven. Um, that's what I kind of thought. And of course we'll go for this like, uh, yeah, we'll go for this one, the pink and green look because Pine Haven and I like pink. Okay, so that's our farm name, Pine Haven Acres. And now we get to pick a jockey. So I'm going to go ahead and put the name as Abigail. Um, I'm gonna put it as Abigail RR because the name of the jockey is the name of the save. So I need to remember that this is not my main save. This is the Rags to Riches save. Um, so we'll go for this uh, person. Now the silks, I used to have, I think it was this, 
this combo, but I've decided recently I like the block colors and I specifically like the gray because it's less likely to clash with colors on the racetrack. I don't know. I tell you what, tell me in the comments if you think I should change it to a different color. I really like this block look. I'm not too much of a fan of too much color. So we can either have this gray. I like this blue. Or of course we can have like obnoxious pink. Um, so you can let me know in the comments what you think. But for right now, I'll just pick the gray. Um, same for the helmet, we'll just go block color and we'll just go black. Um, so this is our rider as of right now. Let me know in the comments if you like a different silk color though. Okay, so we'll save that. So Francis says, Pinehaven Acres, it already feels like a new beginning. Let's head to the stables and meet your stable manager, Sophie. Can do. G'day, I'm Sophie, nice to finally meet you. Let's get straight to it and grab a horse from the market. Aye aye, Captain. <gasps> Ooh, Lawyer's Prospect is really pretty. Ooh, and I'm looking at the stats. Ah. Okay, no, no, this is quite even, to be honest. Yeah, so it's just between Sprint and Acceleration. So I think I'm going to get Lawyer's Prospect, but I'm going to change their name. I'm not a huge fan of that name. Really, really pretty. Now, I will warn you guys, don't get too attached to the low-grade horses, because I most likely will sell them. And it's not easy when you've attached yourself. I might actually... Oh, she wants me to go over here. Okay, so Lawyer's Prospect, I will change that name, looks like a real beaut. All right, see you later. Francis has another goal for you. Oh, key dokey. So we'll go Story. Oh, good. I was just looking for you. There's a race at the local track you should enter. Let's pick out some new jockey silks for our ranch. Okay, I've already done that, so now we're going into straight into racing. Before a race, it's a good idea to um, view your horse's preferences. Okay, so we can see that the position is middle, firm, and 1,000. Let's go back and race. Got you. Thank you, sir. So also, this is Lawyer's Prospect. I want to change their name. And you know what? If you guys pick a name, I might end up keeping her just for what, what's the word? Nostalgia's sake. I might end up keeping her if you guys name her. So let me know in the comments what her new name should be because I don't think she suits Lawyer's Prospect. If we could try and get it to be commentary friendly, that would be great as well. So let's go ahead and uh, select horse. And of course, we're running the race. So let's go ahead and see how our first race goes. Now, I can't remember if you sort of like auto win the first race, but I'm pretty sure you do. <laughs> So this is three oaks. We're only doing 900 meters, so it shouldn't be too long. Unicorn Sorrow, the favorite in an interesting lineup. Unicorn Sorrow is a cool name. That's us. Lawyer's Prospect. Don't like that name, though. All right, here we go. They just throw you straight in. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Yeah, let's go. Okay, I thankfully know how to play this game, so let's go ahead and pull in. Where's the line? Oh yeah, I see it. Okay, I'm not sitting back there though. Oh, oh, up there. Okay, we can move up a bit. I'm using up a lot of sprint though. Excuse me. Oh, that horse is really cute. Oh, <gasps> slow-mo. Refill sprint faster in the preferred position. Rival says, give me the slow-mo ability because that was so cool. We should be able to fly straight around this course. I actually love that paint chestnut that's in front of us. <gasps> I'm hoping to be able to, at the end of the playthrough, grab Sporkle. And maybe sheep, because sheep is iconic as well. Right, let's... Should we move up? No, I'll wait. I think they only start sprinting at about 200 meters, so we should be fine. Alright, I'm going. I'm going, guys. Let's go! Da -da -da -da. Yes! I might run out of sprint, actually. Yeah, I've kind of run out of sprint. Okay, that's not great. Oh my goodness. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. Probably could have gone a bit later, but we won, so it's fine. That's our first... 1260 gold which is great only like 199 million to go even more than that actually a lot more okay so lawyer's prospect is level two good work let's see what we earned completing that goal oh, i forgot you get things from doing the goals as well what do we get as your grandfather used to say, everyone has to start somewhere. A great result for our first outing. However, if we want to keep, compete at higher levels, we need to train our horses. Horses gain XP through racing, which allows them to be trained. Let's go meet our new trainer, Trenton. Got it. I don't remember a trend. Trait. Oh, wait, yes, I do. Um, hi, I'm TJ. Oh, that's why, because his name is TJ, not Trenton. Well, his name is Trenton, but I remember it was TJ. Mr. Kwan hired me to get the training program back on track. Let's head to the training facilities. Okie dokie. So... Yes, we've got items. So we can train. Yay, lawyer's prospect. Uh, we'll do sprint and acceleration. Okay, brilliant, brilliant. Perfect, yada yada, compete at higher levels. We're off to a good start, but there's more to do. Oh, believe me, I know TJ. I know there is a lot to do. Okay, <laughs> we made it to level two. Yay! I think the max level is uh, 20. 
So we got some, oh my gosh, I forgot. They like give you like six different things. So add a fall stall, buy a horse stall, breed a horse. Um, collecting home from the homestead, we can do that. Run 1,400 meters over multiple races, can do that. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna run races. I think that'll be the best because we want to focus on the money. Oh, we can do Sewell Meadows. Is that a good idea? I feel like that's not a good idea. No, that is not a good idea. We're not even on the board, we're so bad. Okay, we'll stick it to three oaks and we'll keep racing here for a little bit. I don't remember when you unlock the jockeys, but I think that will be really helpful for me because I could just then automate the races. But for now, I'm the jockey. <laughs> it's a DIY ranch over here. I'm both the manager and the jockey. Is where all the money is in this race. That's us, okay. So I'm reckoning the path I'll take is sort of unlocking things as quickly as possible and focusing on money because we want to get the good horses to get us through this. Okay. I love Lawyer's Prospect, name pending, um, but we're definitely going to need some better horses. Thanks. I know how to look behind me. I was doing it before Rival Stars. I still need to hang back a bit. I'm not on the line. Oh, hang back. Where's the line? Okay, it's here. We're good. We're good. Here we go. Home straight. Home straight. I think we're in great position. I'm going to hold off on sprinting until here. Now we're going to go. Okay. The line. Oh, uh-oh. 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 I waited too long. I waited way too long. <gasps> no, we're going to do it. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Oh, that was so close. I was... For a second, I didn't think I was going to make it, but I did. Okay. Brilliant. Okay, we did it. So that should unlock the next. And we got a grade up here as well. Brilliant. Okay, uh, so there's, wow, there's loads of things to do. So I think now we can buy a new horse stall. I think we should do that, probably. Add horse stall. So it's three grand. That was a terrifying drill noise. I did not like that. Okay, I did that. How many is she telling me to do? Ah, no, she's just telling me to breed a horse next. Okay, um, I'm gonna leave breeding until maybe the next episode because there's quite a few things that I still need to get done. Um, so I think collect income from the homestead. Do we have any income? Yeah, we do. Okay, brilliant. So upgrading this will also be a priority. Um, oh, complete more goals. Okay. I think we've just done that actually. Okay. It's a decent start, but soon we'll need to fund some substantial expansions. Remember to keep collecting income. Yada yada. Yes, yes, yes. I know how to do this, Francis. Yeah, upgrade the homestead income. So I can actually afford that. And I'm thinking that'll be where for right now my focus will be because while I'm recording, while I'm playing, and even when you're offline, it's gathering money for you. Oh, I love that sound effect. <laughs> wow, this place so, looks so much better. We cleaned up the house and got rid of those ugly vines. Oh yeah, I forgot that it like upgrades the back as well. Okay, awesome. So I think we've done one of our goals. Yes, yeah, so we need to do the storehouse next. I'm not too keen on doing the storehouse right now. Um, right, so prestige three is free roam and four is cross country. Okay, that's new. I haven't I haven't seen that before. So we can unlock race number two. Um, I think I'll just go ahead and run this. Uh, ooh, actually, never mind. We are not going to win that race. She upgraded. I just remembered she she had an upgrade. Okay, let's go ahead and train actually. Train energy, train acceleration. Brilliant. Okay, awesome. So maybe actually we'll, we'll do this facility as well. So now we've got tier two training facilities. That is doable. We're working through it. Um, what else do we need to do? Storehouse, I don't really want to do. 1,600. I, I could definitely do that now, actually. We'll see how they fare in the second three oaks. Are we good in that one? Yes, okay, we can do this one now. Brilliant. Let's go ahead and race this. Look at us in the back. I got such a unique starter horse as well. I'm really I'm really pleased with that. I think she'll give us... She's Rabacana, which I'm not the biggest fan of, but she'll give us some cute babies. Let's go. Ready to rumble. I need to get into the... I need to get on the barrier, and I'm not on the barrier. Oh, let me in. Okay, now I can pull up. Okay. I think I won't start sprinting until 150. Yeah, 150 is fine. Okay, hold, 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 go. Okay, that was a little bit later than I maybe should have. Poop, this chestnut's gonna... No, no, we're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, we're fine. I need to stop doubting myself. I'm going to win the race. I know I know how to race. This will be fine. I think it's because the, like, Queen Victoria... Is it Queen Victoria? I think it is. The Queen Victoria um, races are so much different than, like, the beginning races. Because you literally have to start at, like, 350 meters until the finish line. Otherwise, people are going to come flying past you. Um, so I'm not used to, like, horses, like, pulling ahead like they did and then just running out of stamina. Uh, so I need to, like, 
I need to chill. I know I know how to play this game. Okay, uh, requires facility update. Okay, I think for right now, wait, but the fold doesn't take on the, oh no, the fold kind of does. I shouldn't have done that. I didn't mean to do that. Okay, let's go ahead and train this. Oh, I'm not quick buying stuff. That is something that I put in my how to make how to become a millionaire on rival stars is don't quick buy items It is not worth it. Um, however nice. Oh, we have we've we've done some goals. Okay. I think we've done Yes, we've done the 1400 over multiple races, which is great Impressive your father would have been proud. Thank you Francis. I think the competition is afraid of us. Keep it up will do Okay, um, then we did neat and tidy, which will give us a bunch of tools. Awesome. I know we've only just started cleaning up, but I can already see this place as a charm. We'll get your horses trained up and ready, like just like in the glory days. Thank you, TJ. I really hope we do. All right, um, I don't know if I want to do Sophie's stuff just yet. We'll do the storehouse, because um, if I'm going to be doing more races, we'll need upgraded storehouse. Okay. That's our first one done. So that goal will be finished. It's so good to get some love back into the old, old homestead. I wish your mother was here to see it uh, getting a new lease on life, but she's not interested in the racing game anymore. Okay, so my mother's still alive. My father's not, and she's not interested in what we're doing over here. Okay, so the only thing we've got left to do in terms of goals is add a false stall and breed a horse. Um, I think I will do that then. So false stall is going to cost me a grand, and let's browse the available studs. Okay. This is the bit where I might get diff- like, ha might have trouble because, um, I haven't, like, bred with the, like, normal horses in quite a while, so I'm gonna have to find- So, I think we need better speed and better sprint, so- Because our acceleration's quite good, so a horse- Ah, oh, we're out of that, like, ho like, horseshoe thing. Okay, let me actually check the market to see if there's- Aha, there is! I'll get this as well. Well, it's still cheap. Okay, now we should be able to breed, which is very handy. Oopsies. So we wanted... Yeah, it was this guy, wasn't it? Oh, there's only like... Okay. There's only two to pick from. Okay, so um, we'll go for Perfidious Lightning because uh, they've got the speed and sprint that we, uh, we are lacking. So let's go ahead and do that. I'm quite interested. Okay, so it gives us a free skip, I think, on the 26 seconds. So let's go ahead. This is our first breeding of the Rags to Riches series. Let's go ahead and see what we got from Lawyer's Prospect. <gasps> that is adorable. Oh my goodness. My luck on the first horse is just insane. So this is a grade two. I think that's one up from the mare. Brilliant. Uh, 42, 41, 42. That's brilliant. I'm so, so happy with that. Um, so we can't care for the foal. What should we, what should I name this horse? Um, I'm going to, actually, I'm going to go ahead and name this horse, um, foal so that you guys can go ahead and pick a name for the next episode. So if you want to name Lawyer's Prospect, just put Lawyer's new name should be, insert the name that you think. And uh, if you'd like to name the foal, go ahead and say the foal should, uh, the foal's name should be, insert name here. Uh, I think that would be quite nice so that we can personalize the horses a little bit more. Plus, I'm not very good with naming things. Oh my goodness, she's stunning. Check out the horses for grade. High grade horses can be trained to more advanced levels. Yes, yeah, so the mare was a grade one and this is a grade two. <gasps> stunning, stunning baby. Now I'm thinking if I'm getting you guys to name the horses, I'll get attached to them. So they might end up just going to pasture at this point. Uh, so we've now completed this story. Brilliant. Horses are up on their feet so quick. It took a year for my kid. I'm pretty sure, uh, I'm pretty happy with our first breeding result. We're already producing better horses. We need those high grade horses if we're going to compete internationally. Got it. Um, so when we got some rewards from that. So upgrade foal tier. I think I can do that just now. Actually, how much will it cost? Yeah, it's fine. I can do that now. So I think, I think after we finish this, we'll be at grade three already. No, maybe not. I love being uh, I love being around horses again. It's been a while since I've ridden. I fell off a few years ago and nearly broke my back. Still don't want to give them up completely, you know? Oh, poor Sophie. Okay. Yes! Grade three already. 17 more to go. Okay, brilliant. So that's 1,700 gold. Brilliant. Oh my god, and there's loads more for us to do. So that is it for me today. I'm really excited to do this as a brand new series. Let me know in the comments what you think about this and of course any name suggestions that you have for our fellow horses. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Stay positive and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! <laughs>